Hello, police. Hello, my name is Yuling and I just need to check with you something. Is this SMS from DBS Bank? Huh? So you mean this is a scam? Did you know, in 2021, there were over 2,200 cases of banking-related phishing scams with victims losing over $19 million. We've had a lot of victims falling prey to these type of scams and I really want to help them. What should they do when they get scammed? What happened to all their money? What are we doing about this? And who do I get in touch with? These are very good questions. We are aware of all these scam scenarios and the ever-evolving tactics employed by the fraudsters. At our end, we have put in place various measures to maintain secure systems. For example, we operate cyber security's effort to take down fraudulent websites when they are detected. We also make use of data and AI to detect suspicious transactions and block them. Here's another one. If you receive SMSs or emails with URLs such as these, it is obviously a scam because banks no longer send clickable links. Yes, you should never click on those dubious links or give personal and banking details or OTP to anyone. Customers should only transact only through banks' official websites or mobile app. But what should they do if they suspect that they could be a victim of scam? I really need to help them out. So do I. I'm glad you are here today. Let's dive further into this. So, the first question which I think a lot of people have in mind is, what's the first thing you should do if you fall victim to a scam? Some people say immediately call the police, while others say call the bank. So which one do I call first? The moment you suspect you have been scammed, the first thing you should do is to call the bank to freeze your accounts, cards and e-wallet. If you are a DBS customer, call this number. You don't have to worry even if it happens in the wee hours. We have 24-7 dedicated anti-fraud protocol to help you. We also have full-time staff working in the Police Anti-Scam Centre to provide seamless real-time intervention. After you have done that, quickly lodge a police report. Oh yes, you can proceed to the nearest police station or go online to lodge a police report too. So remember, these two steps. Quickly call the bank and then make a police report. Next question, how much time do I have until my money disappears and where does it go? Oh wait, never mind. This one I can answer because I spoke to some of my friends from the anti-scam centre. So the faster victim reports, the higher the chance of holding on to the funds. Money flow can be very fast and be transferred to multiple accounts, sometimes in a matter of minutes. So don't hesitate, quickly alert your bank and make a police report. Yes, you're right. Once we confirm that your account has been compromised, we will immediately freeze access to your accounts, cards or e-wallet to prevent further fund outflow. It's a team effort and speed is definitely a big factor. This is a tough one. Can victims ever get their money back? I know stories about people who've lost their hard-earned life savings. Well, with our detection measures and strong partnership with the police, we have seen an increase of funds being recovered in January to October 2021 compared to the previous year. However, if the funds are transferred overseas, the chances of recovery are very low. This wouldn't have been possible without a strong collaboration with the banks to clamp down on scammers. That's right. While the police and the banks will do our best to trace the suspects and recover the monies, we still need your help to stay vigilant, look out for each other, and avoid falling victims to scams. So, to wrap it all up, never click on links provided in SMSs or emails. Do not give your personal and banking or OTP information to anyone. If you suspect you've been scammed, quickly alert your bank and make a police report. The faster you report, the higher chance of recovering your funds. Fighting scams is a community effort. You may also look up on scamalert.sg or call the anti-scam helpline at 1-800-722-6688 for the latest information on scams. Thank you so much, Quen. It's been my pleasure. Next time if you have any questions, feel free to contact us. Thank you guys for staying to the end of this video and we hope that you learned something new today. Bye!